Okay, guys, welcome back. Um, today we're going to read the last of our books. Um, last week, you guys read a book about ancient Greece titled Helen of Troy. And today we're going to continue with a similar topic. We're going to read a myth, okay? We're going to read another book uh, about ancient Greece. And uh, it's a book about gods and goddesses, okay? It's titled, How Winter Came Into the World, okay? If you look at the cover, we have one of the main characters, a goddess called Persephone, and she's holding in her hand a fruit, a pomegranate, um, which is um, it's an image of a pivotal moment in the story when things uh, take a dramatic turn, and it has to do with this fruit. Now... In the picture, you can see that on both sides, there is a different image. There is a winter scene with snow and leaves falling on, on her right. And on her left, there is a green prairie full of flowers. And uh, as you can see, the tree is in full bloom. So we have a winter scene and a spring scene because this book is a myth. That it's going to a myth is the explanation that the ancient people, um, when they didn't understand something about nature or anything, they tried to find uh, the logic of it and they tried to give a, an explanation. And, uh, and that's what this book is about is the myth that tries to explain why we have seasons, why the year is not the same every day but there is times during the year when we have when it's cold and other times during the year when it's hot so it's kind of like an explanation of why um why we have different seasons in the year so i'm going to give you some questions now but the instructions don't, don't stop it the instructions today um the instructions today are that you can do the, the activities however you want. You can send me a picture of the activities in your notebook, or you can send me a recording of your voice, reading the questions and giving the answers, or you can send me a Word file, okay? You can send the activities on Word. So let's have a look at the questions. So these are the three questions, okay? Question number one, what are the names of the six gods and goddesses that appear in the story? So if you read this, as you read the story, uh, write down the names of the six gods and goddesses. Gods is for males, for men, and goddesses is for female, for uh, women. Now the next two questions, two and three, are true or false questions, okay? Number two, the home of the gods in ancient Greece was Mount Olympus. Is that true? Is that false? Okay. Not all the gods lived in Mount Olympus, but it says on the, uh, on the book whether that is true or false. Question number three, when the meter found out that Hades had stolen Persephone, she was really happy. Demeter is uh, Persephone's mother, and it's a question about her reaction when she founds out, finds out that Hades, Hades had stolen her. What was her reaction? Was she really happy or not? Okay, and uh, this is wrong. This has to be a four. So question number four is copy the paragraph where Zeus makes his final decision. You can find um, you can find the answer to that question on chapter seven. Okay, as you can see, this is a this is a chapter book. Okay, it has seven chapters. Okay, and on chapter seven, which is the last chapter, you can find the answer to uh, question number four. Copy the paragraph where Zeus makes his final decision on chapter seven, one of those paragraphs it is, okay? So to answer that question, you have to copy it in your notebook or just read the right 
paragraph, okay, that answers question number four. So those are the questions for this week. Uh, I want to thank you for bringing your books to school. Now, if you have not brought your book to school, if you still have your book at home, uh, you can already go or have your parents go to school from nine to three. And there will be a box in the office uh, right when you go into school on the right. Uh, there will be an, uh, a box there for you to leave your uh, English books there. So please, if you have not taken your books to school yet, uh, do that this week if possible. Okay. Uh, and that's it. I hope you like uh, how winter came into the world. And uh, remember that this week we have two classes. So this is the first one. And, uh, and there will be another class about uh, visiting London. So I'll see you then in a couple of days. Bye, guys.